it's Imperial Assault time again. I'm still playing Spectre Cell, because I'm still practicing for regionals. But we figured, of course, I'm going to face other Spectre Cells at regionals. So we're doing a Spectre Cell mirror match. It's going to be interesting. I have the dirty clones. Yeah, the unpainted zombie versions or something. Otherwise, you watch the other videos, you know what our lists are. So we don't even need to break down our list this time. All right, let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> I think Spectre Cell's gonna come out on top. <laughs> we do them one at a time, right? Instead, players alternate deploying groups following the rules for passing. When a figure is deployed, it may move up just eight spaces. Okay, well then, I uh, guess I'll start with Chopper. You got the terminal in the wrong spot. Oh, the okay. terminal's there. So Chopper's gonna go there. Okay, your turn. Uh, go Sabine, one, two, seven, eight. I'll just put her there. Hmm. <laughs> Ezra. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Put the cannon right there. It's gonna be real dumb. I'm gonna put Zab down here. One. Two, three. I'm gonna put Zeb there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, sure, why not? Put Hera here. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's gonna go there. Two, three, four, five. So now at the end of deployment, Hera's a uh, smooth landing. After deployment, you and each adjacent figure gains one movement point. So Sabine's gonna go here, and Hera's gonna go here. You need to dump four block tokens on people. I've given two to Ezra, one to Sabine, one to Hera. Draw three guards. Ezra, oh yeah, Ezra, Ezra gets to go four spaces at the start of the round, starting with my Ezra, because I have initiative. I'm gonna leave him where he is. The fact that you put him there gives me an idea of what's in your hand. You would know better than me. <laughs> oh yeah, for the record, we have identical command decks as well. So I'm assuming he has Pummel in his hand. And the question is, do I want to hit with Ezra and then run away? Yeah, I'm gonna go with Ezra. So I can make an attack on evil Ezra and then bug out. I know you don't have parting blow because that's not in my deck. <laughs> So I get in this respector cell. Right, you get one more from he being has, Ezra. He has one built in, and then I can put my one in the pool for right. a total of three. Yeah, he just gets three already. Can't, you can re-roll that with Kanan because Kanan's within three. Totally need to. Um, oh yeah, I can re-roll stuff too. I can turn and die to any side because Kanan's nearby. I already have more surges than I need. I'm gonna turn this one to that side. Okay, now you can re-roll. So you're blocking four. So you got three surges to work with. Yeah, so I got four damage, three surges, I'll uh, pierce three. So now you're only blocking one. And add two damage. So you got six minus one, six. I'm taking five. Yeah, five on Ezra. Knock, oh, one more because that's built in with Spectre Cell. So six damage. Now uh, I'm gonna use Spectre Cell to have Kanan go. Kanan's gonna go right here. We'll uh, take an attack on Ezra using Element of Surprise. But I still got two, right? Yeah, you have two built in. I'm showing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Minus two? Yeah, that's five. Sounds good. Isn't he dead? Yeah. Ooh, dying lunge? Who are you lunging at? I got Ezra. Okay, I'll spend one of my block tokens. He's got one built in. I'm gonna use Kanan to re-roll that. That turns into... Two blocks and a... Yeah. That. I think you've got <coughs> one surge to work with. To give me pierce three. If you pierce three, you're getting rid of all of this stuff. And I'm still blocking. So one damage gets through. Now Ezra still has one action left. He's gonna go one, two, three, Four. Stand on this thing. Oh, I'll also play Celebration off of that. That was rough. 
only getting one damage in response was even rougher. Well, I've already, I'm already learning that if I play this one and I don't have initiative, I don't want to be within reach of Kanan and Ezra round one. Um, I wrote Hera. So go one, two, and shoot a Kanan. Kanan rolls a black. Blue, green, yellow. Oh, I'm blocking three out of that seven. six. Seven. Seven. Oh, man. So you're taking four? Yeah, I can re-roll it, which doesn't seem great. So, yeah, four and Kanan. And she's got two movement left, so she'll back up where she was. Wow. Oh, no, I can't close the distance. So, I thought I was going to Spectre Cell with Kanan and go after Kanan, but mm. Kanan can't get. You can Spectre Cell to get Ezra, but that's... I mean, wait till Yeah, I mean, later. at the very least, it's going to... Contest that thing. Contest that thing. Uh, <coughs> blocking that. I'm blocking this with... Oh, I suppose I should have tossed in my... Play officer's training on that yellow. Right, so those two cancel each other out. So that those two cancel each other out. That cancels each other out. So you got a damage and a surge to work with? Which I can do pierce three, which is then going to turn that into four damage, right? Yes. And I draw a card because Kanan's a leader. Puts Ezra at five out of ten already. Should have shot Ezra now. I don't know why. Ezra's out of his block tokens already. Yeah, I'll go with Kanan. And with force vision at the start of your activation, your opponent chooses one of his or her ready groups, and that one goes next. I guess I'll go with Kanan next. I forgot he hasn't gone, so. Okay. My Kanan is going to go one, two. <laughs> Swing at your Kanan. Okay. Green, green, and yellow. He's got nothing to add to this attack, just built in specter stuff. Kanan rolls a black. So you're blocking that. Okay, those two cancel each other, these yeah. two cancel each other. So you got that. Oh yeah, I suppose in Mirror Match Spectre, the bonus tokens are, are always just canceling each other out. Right. Uh, so I guess I'll pierce three. Just trying to get that back. One damage back, so. And then I'll add two, so that's five damage. Kanan can re-roll his defense dice, by the way. Oh, that sounds good. Even worse, uh, now you have another search. Yeah. Well, I don't need another search. He only has two, so that's oh. still five damage. Uh, okay, so now your Kanan has to go. Pommel. Uh-oh, on who? Ezra, because he's only got five health left, right? Ezra's got five with a white die. Kanan's got... Uh, if I can put this fool down now, I'll be in much better shape. Kanan's so got since, ten. Yeah. Since mine's dead. All right. Ezra has one of those... Extra ones. Default. That was a good roll, too. That was, what, one, two, three, four, pierce three, five, seven. I mean, that would have greased him had I rolled anything else, probably. Well, you still have another attack, I guess. I do, which blows. Ezra has well, that. Ezra's built in. Yeah, yeah, he's out of the ones he can spend. Those two cancel each other. I've got one. One damage and three surges. So I add two and pierce three. Which gets you three more damage. Even if I use Kanan's reroll. I think he's still dead, right? Because he's dead right now. I think you're doing at least five. Yeah, because this doesn't count, that doesn't All count. All my things go away, and so you've you got plenty one of search. So it's one, two, three, four, four, five. So you get seven points for Ezra. Well, I feel better now we traded Ezra's. Yeah, and your Kanan has Just one more damage than my Kanan. Yeah, <laughs> I feel a lot better now. <laughs> Hera is going to go one... Two, shoot at Sabine. One, two, three, four, five away. Sabine was a white die. Blocking that. I'm showing three damage. That's what it looks like to me, because I forgot to put her token in. She was here. Yeah. One, two, okay. Three, four, put her here. Yeah, we'll put her here. Cheers so how much Sabine can see from where she's at. I don't think. Because I can't see, it has to be two adjacent corners, yes. right? Yes. You can't see. Are you trying to see Sabine? Yeah. From here, I bet, I think you could, right? I thought it be here. But there, no, because I can't see. Well, if you need to move up too, Sabine has a handy evasive maneuver action. I mean, you'll still be standing there where my Sabine can cheer you, but. So I can move two and recover, or I can move two, shoot, and move two back. Yeah, I'll just do the evasive maneuver and heal the two. She'll move up to two. I'm gonna surprise since we couldn't see each other. Oh, in the first place. Okay, well. Because screw that dodge. I'm 
putting that in there at least. So I roll blue, green, green. Two cans on one, because uh, those two wash. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, you and got four and a surge. If I pierce two, I'll get two more damage out of it, right? Yeah. Or you can add one more. To her and one to Hera. Yeah. Five and one or six is essentially. Let's do six to Sabine. Okay. And then one, two, three. I'll parting gift right there. Into the, the just space to, where Sabine is? Yeah, just to hit Sabine. Nothing, right? Hmm. And that's Sabine. Well, I'm going to go with Sabine. <laughs> She is going to shoot at your Sabine. Range one, two, three, four. So four damage. Yep. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Shit. Just to hold on real quick, fella. I'm going to put her damn token in the Oh, do it. She doesn't have pierce. Sabine does have pierce, oh, too. Yeah. Anyways. Uh, I'm going to use Hera's ability to get a surge to, I guess, uh, pierce two. Okay. So these two go away, those two still wash. So, so five, five damage. Well, now our Sabines are on even footing with damage. Don't you have one more action? Yep. Uh, well, before I do that, I'm going to do my parting gift at your Sabine. Ooh, and then she's going to evasive maneuver to go one, two, and recover two. Now mine only has four damage. I'm going to lose that and try and keep the pressure on. Three, four, right? Yep. One, two, three, four away. I need a dodge. Boom, just like that. Mm. Uh, so two damage? That's what it looks like. Well, they're back up to six again. Guess we'll go with Zeb. He's gonna go one, two, three. Shoot at Kanan because- Kanan's got a token. How far away is it? One, two, it's only three away, can't miss. One damage? Let's see if we re-roll that. Oh, then sir. Okay, two damage. My go. Yep. She leaves me with Chopadopolis. So system shock. Okay, so two damage on Chopper and a strain. Oh, that hurts. There goes Rebel Graffiti. Excellent. <laughs> Sitting on the top of my deck. Excellent. That's not good. And then I'm just gonna sit there because I want to cap a point and draw an extra card. So yeah, shock away, right back at you. I'm gonna take the three damage because I don't want to <laughs> lose graffiti. <laughs> Although that means I can't survive another one of those. Yep. Oh, uh, maybe I will. <laughs> oh, Griff, show me graffiti. Pummel. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, that way, uh, that way I can make it to turn three. Okay, so end of the round, we each draw two cards. Then we each get two points for each critical position that we control. So I have one, two, three, four. So I get six points. Yeah, eight points. Yep. <laughs> That's how math works. <laughs> and and you've got six. three, yeah. Oh, okay, so now end of round effects, I don't have any. Do you, have, you don't have any end of round effects, do you? No. Okay. You have initiative. Start of round effects. There's no Ezra's to scuttle around. Is there any other start of round effects? I don't have any. No. I don't think so. All right, so you go first. Then you do five to Sabine. Yep. I go for that. Go for that assassination run. Um, I'm gonna go with Zeb. He's gonna go one, two, three, four. <laughs> and so I get to make my shot, and then the bull rifle staff strike, right? Yep. So here's my shot. Okay. Uh, looking like three, three damage. It's me at nine, he's only got two left. And then two red dice. Mm-hmm. Here we go. Big money, four damage. That's seven points for you. Anything else on Zeb's turn? Nope, he moved and then he swung and he shot. Yeah, I think we can get rid of Kanan. We're gonna try this. I'm gonna go to Hera. One, two, three and shoot at Sabine. So I got three hit points left. You need that dodge, lady. Two damage. You said she needs three? I can surge for one more. Make that three damage. Yeah. Whew. Okay, you get seven. Yeah, that was dumb, because you know what I wanted to do? Go with Sabine? My next move was gonna be to go with Sabine and come over here and kill Chopper and just get rid of him. Well, my next move is gonna be, I'm gonna go with Spectre Cell 
for Kanan to attack Kanan. Still has activation, but I'm going with Spectre Cell for Kanan. Against your Kanan. Yeah, so I can surge to pierce three, and then surge to do two more, so one, two, three, four, five, six damage. Still alive. Still alive, huh? Okay, then, still Hera's turn, I'll play Strength in Numbers, use after I resolve a group's activation, I can immediately activate another group, Kanan, because their combined cost does not exceed 12. So I'll go with Kanan. Oh, because it was Hera? Yeah, and attack Kanan. Got that reroll. I think he's dead. Kanan has one action left. I guess he's just gonna move here. I'm gonna heroic effort. Uh, so you still have Zeb. Zeb and Chopper haven't gone yet. All right, I'm gonna go with Chopper. System shock. Two more on Chopper, and we're getting rid of take initiative. And then he's just gonna use another action to pass. And then we use Spectre Cell on Hera before I still have a choice. So she's just gonna move there. And mm -hmm. that's my one, two, three, four range shot. You got two surges to work with. So Pierce two? Yeah. Two, da two damage on Kanan? Puts him at six. Okay, I'm gonna go with Zeb. Zeb is gonna go one, two, three. Have a little knuckle down with that Zeb. So we'll shoot him with the gun and then we'll hit him with the bow rifle. Four damage. To Zeb? Yep. And then bow staff rifled. Four more. Okay, that's Zeb. That's all your guys, right? I have Harris still. Oh yeah, you Spectre. I use Spectre, so. I just have Chopper. I don't know why I moved Zeb. I just had to leave him standing there and I would win at the end of this round. <laughs> just take a shot at uh, Kanan. What a girl. Another Pierce, you got another two damage. Two damage. Kanan has eight out of 14. One, two, three, four. Might as well just bank the points there. Uh, well, I'll go with Chopper. Chopper's gonna shock your Chopper. Give her a celebration. Bye bye, celebration. And then he's gonna move back onto this thing. Actually, I have initiative. I'll be able to zap your guy first. That's everything, right? Oh, damn it, you're 34 already? If I had left Zeb here, that would have won right now. Yeah. So I get one, two, three, four. I don't think there's any end of round stuff. We each draw two cards. And it comes to me. Any start of round effects? Take initiative. I, luckily I just drew negation. I'll go a chopper. I'll kill your chopper. Which is funny because it would have, wouldn't have changed much because I would have tapped him down and oh, he sure. stuck there. Well, I mean, I, if I, you kind of had to get Chopper out of there though, because if I kill him, now I get 41 points. Yeah. I had thought that a Spectre mirror match would be kind of fun, and it kind of wasn't. Right? <laughs> it was really lame. Well, it would have been. Have fun at the tournament. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's what I can expect. The one time I rolled a dodge on Ezra was a big deal, because it kept you from attacking If I had remembered to use Spectre Cell that turn that I Well, had. yeah, you would have knocked off Chopper with Sabine and maybe got two more health back on her. If anybody watching has tips for Spectre Cell versus Spectre Cell beyond don't bother. Other uh, than uh, for me to just play better. <laughs> let us know in the comments because this is why I'm taking to regionals. I expect this will be most of my day. <laughs> At regionals, so this. yeah, I shouldn't have got it for the pummel since I didn't have initiative. But you can still see it because if I would have ran right into your face, you'd have just been like, mm, "I'm gonna back out one of these guys." Right. Yeah. I think that's my biggest. That just makes it like is... lose lose on trying to pummel first turn. Yeah, I. If I don't have initiative, I don't want to be anywhere near. Enemy, Kane and Ezra, round one. That's the moral of the story today, kids. <laughs>